Greetings lords and ladies, Kaiser here, and welcome to another episode of Mountain Blade Gekko Kujo Daimyo Edition. Now, when last we left off, I was debating whether or not it would be a good idea to just straight up join the Date clan and start fighting for the clan. But then it hit me, like, I remembered that if you join a clan, you suddenly don't really have that many options of increasing relations with them, at least not easy options, such as bringing uh, messages to other lords and such, or perhaps busting lords out of prison and stuff like that. Like, the relationships that you can afterwards gain is more or less just intrigue within the clan itself, like trying to infringe... Uh, or rather trying to do some espionage and besmear the name of a div besmirch sorry the name of another lord or something like that so i was i actually decided that you know what it it's wouldn't be a bad idea to first do a lot of missions for the date lords increase our relations because if we do that that means that once we actually do join the date um when they conquer or we conquer new lands, it would be much, much easier for those lands to be given to us. Not to mention, since last time, I basically just made it to Sendai, and would you look at this. There is a tournament going on here. This would be an excellent icebreaker if we find Lady Hina in here, which hopefully we will, but first things first, let us join the tournament and do our very best, and from what I saw it was 13 to 1 when it came to uh, the bet, which means that we will be getting the maximum amount of gold from this tournament, so that would be about 4,000. There we go, first bout done, wow, we took out all three of them ourselves, uh, well, Musashi's already out of the tournament, oh well, what do we have, ah, uh, this weapon again, I'm not even sure what this weapon is called, I be, I'll be completely honest, I think it's a Naginata, probably, uh, whatever it is, it's very slow and I really, really dislike it, like, I, wow, Great Lord Data, that was you, um, Hmm. Where was the eye patch? They're focusing on me, meaning that my men, or rather, my boys, can just focus on them. There we go. Uh, Lord Iwaki, you were on our team. Nice. I don't really know who you are, but nice. Let me see if I can. No. Okay, I, I thought to myself, let me see if I can maybe manage to get a headshot, but I didn't. Veteran Hired Warrior, wow, you actually took the Onabushi down, interesting. They aren't usually that strong. There we go, we won the tournament, we won some more gold, and more importantly, or <laughs> I know that it's not really uh, more importantly, but we can enter, and there she is. Lady Hina, you must be Otto. We have just had the honor of watching you distinguish yourself in the recent tournament. Can I help you with anything? Yes, indeed, my lady. I would like to dedicate my success in this tournament to you. Do you? Why, what a most gallant thing to say. And it increased by 8 Exxon. And once we click this, my lady, I would like to profess myself your most ardent admirer. You are a most gallant young man, and I would like it very much if we could see more of each other. Wow, that increased it by an additional 5. Usually when you uh, profess yourself an ardent admirer, at least in the, in the vanilla, if I remember correctly, it usually decreased um, the relationship you have with them. But yeah, there we go. Now, every once in a while, we will be asked by the lady to come and visit her. Now, the feast is still going on, of course, and if I'm not mistaken, it's barely dawn, so there will most likely be some more tournaments, unless the lords literally just get out of the... I was kidding. Oh no, the feast is still going on. Wait, then where are they going? I I think I saw a... Um, what are they called? A Mogami clan lord somewhere around here so maybe they're trying to chase that guy down i'm not sure uh let me 
explore a little bit more. Yeah, the feast is still going on, but are there going to be any more tournaments? That's my question. Yes, there is. All right. In that case, guys, I will be making a cut right here as always. And I will see you guys once the tournaments are over with the general report. All right, welcome back, guys. Now, there was only one tournament left. I literally saw the... Wait, no, I didn't mean to click that. No! Ah. No, leave. All right. I literally saw the lords uh, coming back to the uh, to the town and then suddenly just turning around. <laughs> like, they changed their minds immediately. Um, now, let's see. What could we do? Now, uh, of course, we won the tournament, but... Uh, accompanying Lord Kakada's party. But for now, let us see if Great Lord Date has any sort of missions for us. Do you have any tasks for me? No, there's the eye patch. There we go. If they have something you could help me with, an issue with the lawless villain known as Shimotsuke the oil merchant. He murdered one of my men. Uh, then I will hunt him down, of course. Now, which village was he from? The village of Aizu. Mm, that's quite far, but, I mean, usually it won't be, but due to the decreased speed on this mod, and yes, that is really, I'm sorry that I keep bringing it up, but it is really a, bar a bothersome thing. Now, I saw that the um, mod creator said that it is for strategic and tactical reasons, but it kind of diminishes the gameplay, I believe, just a little bit, because, like... Imagine you having a village around, in, like, Nagai. And, for instance, let's say that you that your clan is fighting in Edo. You're in Edo. And suddenly a Mogami vassal goes and starts looting Nagai. Usually on the vanilla, I'm pretty sure that you could still make it in time to actually stop him from just burning down your village. But with this kind of speed, it would take two to three days to get from Edo to Nagai. So, your villages are automatically, um, well, royally screwed, so to speak. Uh, not to mention that it takes a lot, lot more gold to just move around, considering the fact that, you know, it takes a lot more time to go around, meaning many, many more weeks go by. Uh, I'm looking for that guy, yes. Now, if I'm not mistaken, he's just gonna be behind one of these buildings, so... Let's go on the outside. There he is, alright. We'll actually dismount, take our sword out. We already know what he's gonna say. Uh, alas, that you cannot be made to see reason. And he's down, there we go. Mission complete. I know, I know, I know you guys don't like me murdering people in your villages. Who would? <laughs> but... It was something I had to do. Now, report honor rating. Our honor rating is 6. Now, if we wanted, we could simply say no to the reward for hunting this guy down. And I believe that actually increases our honor rating by 1. But is it worth it? Like, I, I like money. I'm sorry, I like money. Oh, hey, Musashi is actually ready to upgrade. Or rather, level up. Strength 15, there we go. That's the last point in that that you will get afterwards i believe that musashi yeah you are going to be a our tactician train dot spearman veteran dot spearman there we go wait it's still a date lord so hmm so we're getting about 500 mon from the two enterprises. Now you can see that if we had like i don't know five or six of these enterprises we would most likely not really be losing that many that much mon for uh the upkeep of our army do you have any tasks for me great lord chosakabe the chosakabe clan oh god that is far away um i doubt i'll be seeing him i'm very sorry about that but do you have anything else i can help you with no okay kochi good sir is almost on the other side of Japan, so for sure I am not gonna be doing that. Uh, so let's continue towards Sendai. We have to find Great Lord Date. Now if I'm not mistaken, 
I'm actually, I, I just remembered, guys, that I keep forgetting, if I'm not mistaken, if you talk to uh, the lord of the town where the feast is being held, it automatically increases your standing with them by, well, slightly, but still, it, uh, you know, it increases it. And I just realized that I kept forgetting to actually talk to any lords whatsoever. My name is Otto, at your service. Do you have any tasks for me uh, that I will... I'm not interested. No, I will not be a mercenary. I need to deliver of Mogami clan in Yamagata castle. Sure, that's much, much closer. I might as well head in that direction. Oh, great lord Dante, there you are. Wow, you have a pretty big army. About the task you gave me, yes, I found him and gave him his punishment. We got 300 experience, which is, which is nice. Um... This is blood money, I can't accept it. Now, do we say no to the 300 mon and gain some more honor? Or do we take the money and just, well, flat out don't really gain anything else? Um, I'm pretty sure that for now it's a good idea to have this. I mean, to get the money. You probably know that I am lord of the village of Aizu. Wow, you really want me to pick on Aizu a lot. A fair offer, my lord. We have an agreement. Alright, so we will be going back to Aizu, and hopefully this time it'll go better than it went last time when it was... Which village was it? I think it was Kuana, right? Where we were trying to collect taxes and the villagers just revolted against us. Uh, Alright, so let's head to Aizu, speed, the, speed it up. Come on, let's get there. You see what I mean? It takes a full day to just get from Sendai to Aizu, and that's not even like... It's the, I mean, distance of, well, pretty much a town, not much more. Uh, I saw that somebody is ready to upgrade. Yes, they are. Alright. So, wait, why is it being raided? Go away. Oh, come on! Okay, it's not being raided anymore. Alright, collect taxes, start collecting. Ignore them and continue. This time, I'll be much more careful if they actually rebel and just... make sure we actually fight them down correctly. To be fair, guys, last time I honestly... Like, I have never failed this mission before. And so, last time, I didn't know that if you fall, suddenly everybody else, I mean, just stops fighting, apparently. Uh, alright, so our relationship with them has deterio deteriorated even further, so we probably shouldn't expect to get any volunteers from Aizu anytime soon. Lord Hisatsuno of Amaka uh, has escaped from captivity. Right, I haven't really been paying attention at all to all these messages, because there's simply too many of them. Maybe once, uh, maybe once they lose most of their... Oh god, I'm very, very sorry about that noise, guys. Uh, just a sec. Very sorry about that, guys. That was very, very unprofessional of me. I could have sworn I closed my browser before beginning uh, the recording session. So, uh, for all any of you that checked your own Facebooks for messages, I'm very sorry about that. <laughs> I did not mean to troll you. Uh, right, so... Where is Great Lord Date? He's not around here. But we also have a mission to go to Yamagata. Ah, oh, it's being raided. There we go. Yeah, we just got asked by our lady to come and visit her. First things first. Alright, so yeah, everybody's at Yamagata Castle, including most likely Great Lord Date. Yes, he is. So, first things first, we are going to finish the mission we had with him that increased our standing with him even further we got about 300 mon yeah okay so that's fine uh before i accept any new missions is the lord that i'm supposed to meet here no he is not all right so lord tateoka wonder where he is maybe in ichinoseki or maybe tsuruoka let's see Let's just go there. Hopefully we will meet him. We have to give him the message still. And before I find out that he was defeated by that Data army and is being held captive somewhere. Wait, there's no lord in here. Hmm. 
Could he be in Yokote or Kobot Kubota? Please don't let this be another goose chase. Well, not a goose chase, but just wait. Well, it's not him, but we can still ask him where the Lord is. So, Hale, let's go in. Veteran Mogami Retainer. Ah, Lord Narisawa. I am Otto at your service. Uh, I wish to ask you something. The location of Lord Tateoka. Eh, the feeling should be between Aizu and Agano. Wow, okay, so we went in the exact opposite direction than where he is. So, between Aizu and Agano. Wow. Alright, let's get there. I will make a cut right here, guys, just to make sure that it doesn't get any... The episode doesn't really dry up, so to speak. So, I will see you guys in just a little bit. Welcome back, guys. Here we go. I believe we found him. Wait, that's Lord Uji. There he is. There he is. We found him. Okay, so apparently they were... They were doing some of their own raiding. Uh, I bring a message from Lord Oninila. Oh, let me see that. Hmm. You're very welcome, sir. Uh, now, is... Oh, Yamagata Castle actually got taken over by the Date. I'm trying to remember if, if historically it belonged to them or not. Like, I'm pretty sure that they defeated the Mogami clan. Uh, they were... The Date were very, very aggressive. Especially when Masamune Date um, took charge. Even after the Takeda were defeated... I mean, the Hojo and the Takeda were defeated. That's when the Date really started to get aggressive. <laughs> Basically, when things started to simmer down, because, you know, uh, the... Uh, what is it called? The Sengoku Jidai basically was a complete and total chaotic time in Japan. Like, clan was fighting versus clan. Uh, Vassal was fighting versus his lord. That is actually where Gekokujo comes from. Gekokujo literally means those beneath... Um, well... What's the word? See, here's this is where me being a non-native English speaker comes in because sometimes I just my brain just completely freezes and I forget the words. Um, not uplifting them, but overthrowing them. Right, those beneath overthrowing those above. Uh, do you have any tasks for me, Otto? But I was no, I wouldn't really like to train troops right now. I'm very sorry about that. Wait, do you have any other missions, perhaps, for me? I still saw that you had something available for me. Do you have any tasks? No, nothing. All right. In that case, next. I wonder if Great Lord Date is anywhere close. We meet again. Yes. Do you have any uh, that? No, I do not wish to be then. Mogami Clan, Kubota currently. Sure, we'll head to Kubota, why not? Is there maybe anything going on in Sendai? Oh, right, if nothing else, wait. Uh, our lady is waiting for us at Iwaki Castle, which is... There it is. Alright, so let's first head there, actually. Meet our lady, increase our relationship with her a bit. So... Onwards to Iwaki Castle. Wait, how much gold do we actually have? 18,000. Mm. I really, really want to do one more tournament or something and get one more enterprise going. I really, really do. Attempt to visit a lady. Whom do you wish to visit? Visit Lady Hina. The guards glare at you, and you know better than to ask permission to enter. However, as you walk back towards your lodgings, an elderly lady dressed in black approaches you. I am Lady Hina's nurse, she whispers urgently. Wait for a while by the spring outside the walls. I will smuggle her ladyship out to meet you, dressed in the guise of a ship herdis. Isn't it a sheep herdis? But sure. But I beg you, for all of our sakes, be discreet. Certainly. Oh, well, this is not exactly by the spring now, is it? Oh god, now we have to actually find her where she is. 
Oh, there she is. Hello, Lady Hina. There we go. And now we can finally use the poetry that we've practiced reciting and paying for. <laughs> uh, all right, let's do it. It increased it. There we go. So we're already at 19 with her. That is quite, quite nice. Do you think we have a future together, sir? It is comforting to hear that your intentions towards me are honorable, but perhaps we should take the time to get to allow our inf affections, infections, wow, that would have been a wrong way to put it, our affections for each other to grow a little stronger before making any such decision. Uh, very well, I shall continue to strive to be worthy of your esteem. For sure. Alright, now, Lord Iwaki, let me just check something, uh, the lady reports, wait, uh, where is it, where is it, where, relation, no, not relations report, well, return to previous menu, uh, courtship relations, that's the one, Lady Hina, uh, okay, I thought I could click on her, I'm acting like I've never played this game before, uh, now it's, Characters, Lady Hina. So Lord Iwaki is her brother, and so is Lord Kakeda. So being on good terms with him would definitely, definitely help us in the long run. Uh, do you have any tasks for me? No, nothing. Fine. <laughs> Fine then. Uh, so we do have the mission to go to Kubota, but first let's head past Sendai, just to see if anything's going on there. Or perhaps if anybody else wants us to bring any messages to any lords in the Mogami clan. If, since we're already going in that direction, right? Uh, let us see, mailing. Uh, we said that you will be a right a, an expert in wound treatment. However, since your agility is 8, let's put it up to 9, okay? Let's do that. Give you some more writing do that uh, and from now on we will be focusing on your intelligence and wound treatment uh, Lord Shiroishi Shiroishi all right nobody's in there uh, about the task you oh we already have the ta the task we have is from him right okay so let's just head to Kubota uh, we'll see if we meet any more Date Lords on our way there. But if not, I will be making a cut right here until we actually get there. Wait, there is a Lord. And it's Lord Kakeda. Very, very nice. Okay, so you guys apparently are not sure whether or not you want to fight those guys. <laughs> Do you have any... No tasks for me. Wow! Okay, what about you, Lord Inawashiro? No lord should have to... Oh, no! Anything else? Promise? No. Why is he giving me only the kind of missions that I don't want to take? And I know I'm being picky, but I really... Uh, right now I'm interested in the missions that require me to bring messages. <laughs> uh, lord Hayashizaki. Let's actually ask Lord Uji if... Oh no! no. There, he, there he is. Oh god, they're fighting versus... Lord Endo's party, Great Lord Date's party. Wait, are they gonna help them, or are they not gonna help them? That's the question here. Because this... If they actually went in, this would be a mass battle. Like, what is that? Uh, 600 troops versus... It would be... Yeah, it would be about the same amount, but they're not gonna going in to help them. Wow. You guys are... Very, very... Dickish, so to speak. To your own lords. Lord Ujiya, Great Lord Mogami, Akita, uh, Hayashizaki. That's the guy we want to talk to. Let's head in. Hello? Hello? Lord Hayashizaki? There he is. Alright. At your service. Uh, I bring a message to you from that guy. Yeah. Shiroishi. Oh, great Lord Mogami. 
Lord Onoki. He's still fighting a Mogami retainer. What's going on over there? Lord Uji's party is fighting versus Great Lord. Okay. So let me first check if this guy wants me to do anything. No. Anything else? No. All right. In that case, do we just wait for this battle to finish? Or do we actually go in to help them? If we do that, it will decrease our standing with the Mogami, which I'm not really interested in just yet. Let's see how long this battle is going to take. It shouldn't take that much longer. Yeah, it's going pretty poorly for the Mogami. Oh, wait. A lord came out and just <clears throat> rejoined the battle afterwards. Uh, okay. Why do they keep leaving and re-entering the battle? That's kind of strange. Uh, so, veteran Date, Date Hatamoto Guard. There we go. Though, if I'm not mistaken, if you take the mission to... Whoa, 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 whoa. Great Lord Date, wait, 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 wait. I want to talk to you. Do you have a mission for me? Do you have any task? Great Mogar in Yamagata Castle. Oh, I get it. So the Mogami actually retook Moga uh, Yamagata Castle. I see. I didn't even notice that. But we have to talk to the Great Lord. That will further increase our standing. Now, I am only interested in actually increasing my standing with the Date Great Lord and no other Great Lord. Because Great Lords tend to do this thing where when their clan is destroyed, they just vanish from the map. At least they did in the um, vanilla version. So yeah, that's one thing that I really eh, won't be doing. Like, if we capture an enemy Great Lord... Um, we will be keeping him. We will not be releasing them. Uh, I'm too busy for that, but okay. So I'm too busy for one thing, but you don't have any missions to do the, and the different thing. We meet again. Do you have any tasks? Why does everybody want me to train troops for them? All right. No, I will not be doing that. Uh, another thing we have to do. Well, not have to, but would be a good thing to do is actually increase our standings with these uh, outlying villages. Because the uh, higher our relationship with them, the more recruits will be willing to join us. Is there anything I can help you with? Uh, their pastures are empty, then I will bring you the cattle you need. Two heads of cattle, that shouldn't be too difficult, so let's just head over to Matsushima, who also has a pretty high st standing with us, if I'm not mistaken. Well, an eight. Find work in the village. Wait, what? An old widow needs help building a new farmhouse. The work is straightforward. You will work for three days under the total care of the villagers. They will feed and house you. They have no money, however, and at the end of the three days you will be paid in kind. You're bringing 58 of your people to work with you. The employer promises to assign you as their foreman. You have six samurai in your party refusing to join in. They promise to stay in guard, however. I'm actually curious, what does this do? I've no, I, I have never seen this before. This must be something new for, uh, that was added in this submod. Right, but it takes us three days. Wow, yeah, we don't have high engineering. Most likely if we had a lord with high engineering, which we will have eventually, of course, this would be much, much easier. But for now, we don't. Uh, weekly budget, yeah, we're still going into minus. I know, I know, I know. I know, I know, I know. We really should be looking for some more tournaments, guys. <laughs> uh, tell the lady that I will be coming shortly, yeah. Sort of shortly. Shortly. The grateful villagers lacking money compensate you with six baskets of fruit. They welcome you back anytime. And that gives us nine. Alright, but right now I need, well, not supplies, but, um... No, don't go to the village center. Meet the village headman. Uh, I wish to buy supplies. I wish to buy some cattle. Yeah, both of them. Okay, so we are losing even more money. But let's say that it, that it is worth it. Drive the cattle onward. 
Uh, Osaki. There we go. Did they go in? They went. All right. So meet the village headman. There we go. Our standing with them is now eight. Excellent. 400 experience. It's not that much, but hey, it's something. My good sir, our village has been through such hardships lately. The harvest has been bad, and recently some merciless bandits took away our seed that we had reserved for the planting season. How much rice do you need? Five sacks of brown rice. Now, that shouldn't be too, too hard. I know I keep complaining about uh, about our money situation, but it should be fine, guys. Like, what, if push comes to shove, I will just do melee fights, which I believe is the best way to go about <laughs> this uh, map speed. I mean, to counter the map speed. Uh, recruit, no, wait, I have to go into the marketplace, goods merchant. Wait, they need brown rice, right? Not white rice. Brown rice. Okay, so we can only buy two bags here. That will not be enough for them. Wait, what we will also do is buy some white rice for ourselves. <laughs> uh, just to make sure what's going on in Choshi. Okay, nah. We're not heading to Choshi just yet. Though it is relatively close. How long do we have to complete this? 30 days. So if we head that way, like we have to go to another town to actually buy some more brown rice anyway. Not to mention we do have to go to Iwaki Castle to meet our lady. So I guess we could potentially do all of the above. And if there's still a tournament in Choshi, that will be a nice boost to our economy. Uh, so yeah, I believe that is something I will do. So in between the episodes, guys, all I will basically do is head to Iwaki Castle, meet our lady, recite some poetry to her, uh, and then head towards Mito. And then depending on what Mito tells me, like I'm sure that I'll get the three additional sacks of brown rice and Mito, but depending on what they tell me, like if there's still a tournament in Choshi, I will be going to Choshi and I will see you once we get there. If not, in that case, I'll just head back to Osaki and I will meet you once I get there. So, guys, thank you very much for joining me. Um, this has been Kaiser. I hope to see you guys next time. And until then, as always, Ad Gloriam.